So, so on behalf of the board, I'd like to welcome Coach Kelly and Coach Sweeney to the Cotton Bowl. Uh, we also would like to welcome the families. We've had the chance over the last few days to spend time with, with the, the group of people from both teams, and it's an impressive bunch, and uh, it's, it's an honor to have you here. Uh, we look forward to you taking the field tomorrow. It should be a great matchup, and we're sure it'll add to the legacy that's the Cotton Bowl. So we, we are very, very, very honored to welcome and host the Notre Dame Fighting Irish and the Clemson Tigers. Presenting her artwork to Irish head coach Brian Kelly, the first place winner in the fifth and sixth grade category from Vaughn Elementary in Frisco, 11-year-old Katie Zow. The first place winner of the first and second grade category from Gulledge Elementary in Plano, seven-year-old Chloe Nee. The first place winner of the third and fourth grade category from Colin Powell Elementary in Grand Prairie, nine-year-old Darian Brooks. So we can hear from the winner of the Dan S. Petty Scholar Athlete Award from Notre Dame, Drew Tranquil. Man, I just wanted to thank the Goodyear Cotton Bowl Classic for this tremendous honor to represent my team as our scholar athlete. Obviously, I wouldn't be the person I am today without my family, without my wonderful wife, Jackie, and without all the incredible staff here in Notre Dame, my coaches, all our front office people, all the academic service people, and all the uh, aerospace mechanical engineering department that helped me get to where I am today. It's truly an honor. Can't wait to get this thing kicked off. Go Irish, and God bless. Let's direct our attention to the video screens, please, so we can hear from the winner of the Dan S. Petty Scholar Athlete Award from Clemson, Christian Wilkins. I just want to thank, give a special thanks to my coaches, uh, my, my mom, my family, uh, just all the educators out there who've been a part of my life, uh, all the learning specialists, academic advisors, uh, just all the people who've helped me get to the point, get to this point. Um, I'm looking forward to playing the game. Go Tigers! We also like to congratulate Clemson. Dabo Sweeney on a terrific year, outstanding football program, a model of consistency in college football. Um, it's going to be a great game tomorrow. Um, I'm not certain I want to watch Clemson's highlights. Um, they're going to be about 20 minutes longer. Um, but uh, I think uh, from our perspective, uh, we certainly uh, feel as though uh, our football team has put together an outstanding football season, has been challenged um, on the road. Uh, it's been challenged by the Big Ten, uh, the Pac-12, the ACC, and uh, has put ourselves in a position uh, to play in the college football playoffs. So uh, again, from our perspective, um, we have such a great deal of respect uh, for our opponent, uh, but certainly are absolutely um, looking forward to a great challenge and a great football game tomorrow. Again, thank you for being here. Our hosts have been outstanding, uh, but as the clock ticks, I think we're all getting ready and excited about tomorrow. Thank you very much. Uh, it's been a great week here in Texas. We've had an awesome time. and. Uh, our team has had an amazing season, uh, regardless of what happens tomorrow night. And let me tell you, we are playing an unbelievable team. I, I, I would like to say I enjoyed watching all the tape, uh, but there's just really no weaknesses with this Notre Dame team. They're incredibly well coached, coordinated on both sides, very balanced, and, uh, and you can tell they're a team. You know, you can just, as a coach, you can watch a team and you can kind of see the heartbeat. Uh, and they are the epitome of that. Uh, so this is going to be a great matchup. I have no doubt about it. Uh, we're excited to be a part of it. Our team has had an amazing season, um, really a historic season. You know, this is the, the most seniors I've ever had, incredible leadership. We have 26 graduates, which is the most of any bowl team in the country of all the bowl teams. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We, for us, we set our school record. We had 66 guys make a 3.0 or better. And uh, so I'm really proud of this team. 
So just, just a historic season on and off the field for our group, and uh, they have certainly earned the right to be here to play on such a big stage in an unbelievable venue like AT&T Stadium. So uh, thank you all for being here. We look forward to being a part of it. I know Coach Kelly's probably got a meeting to go to just like I do. So uh, with that, uh, look forward to seeing everybody in the Dome tomorrow for a wonderful college football matchup. Go Tigers.